failure in, in sports is part of that learning process. You know, not, not all teams can always win, and, and um, you know, quite frankly, I, I'm glad that my son doesn't always win every game because losing teaches a lot about a person and, and is, a, is a learning moment uh, as well, a teaching moment as well. And you know, even even recently, I know that uh, my son was fortunate enough to be in a, in a championship game for a hockey tournament, and, and they didn't win. And it was heartbroken, you know. It was. I came down to you know everything you could expect, and it was very exciting. But they lost, and and he, he and he's he's crushed with that. What a teaching moment! Because basically, what I did, you know, um, on the way home, and you know, and after we got home, we had arm around him. You know, did you try your hardest? And and when I told him, I said, what's more important to me is that you tried your hardest. I'd rather have you try your hardest and lose than if you went out there and didn't compete and won the game. And asked him, what do you think about that? And he agreed with me. That that was that made me feel good that he agreed with me, and I, and I think I believe that he felt that way. But to me, that was that was a teaching moment. And how do you teach that if there's always a positive result and things? So I think that's a great example of a teaching moment.